Hi, let's talk about long person's name. So your friend is typing his name into a keyboard. Sometimes when typing a character C, the key might get long passes and the character will be typed one more time. So this is the example and you do have to check uh, the character in the name. Name string is equal to, is exactly inside the type, type string. But the problem, the constraint is this. You do have to type one or more time, right? So imagine your your first character, right, does not match, then what does that mean? This means these two children are definitely not equal because it does have to type one or more time. And also, if the character you traverse is not equal to the previous uh, previous character, then it's return false right away because um, when you check the condition, you do have to check, you do have to check if they are the same, if they are the same, then you move on. If they are not the same, you do have to check does my previous character uh, match with the current character. So if they are not the same, then you uh, definitely uh, know this is something that is not, it's not the key inside the, it's not a character inside the name tree. So I'm going to write down and then you will see what happened. So the base case for the for this problem is check if the name string is equal to the type string. So I can just say if name does equal type. If this is true, return true. If they are not true, you can say int i equal to zero. The i is actually represent the pointer for the name string. Name string, and also I have to say m is equal to the name dot length. And also, n is equal to type dot length. I'm, I'm going to make it a short, short abbreviation for the string name. And also, my my pointer for the type string, right? I have a pointer for the type string, which is j equal to 0, j less than n, j plus plus. And also, the first thing is I have to check if the length of char and for my i, for my i pointer is equal to the type dot char at and my j, right? So I have two pointer, which is point at i, a, the, I mean the first character uh, on the name string and the type string, right? So if they are, they are the same, I have to, I have to move on my i, i pointer, because j is definitely increasing increment every single time, right? But also, if you have to move on, right? I mean, in increment your i, you do have to know i has to, has to less than n. This is the function, right? And also, what is the else statement? So, else if, if this is not, a, if this is false, which means uh, the character are not matched, right? And if the index is equal to zero, which is not allowed, right? I return false. Because you do have to press uh, uh, a number, I mean the amount, the type one or more times, right? So at least one character will, will be matched for each character. But if this is false, then you move, move on to the else if statement. If j is equal to zero, the index is equal to zero, then you return false. It's not correct. And also, if the type character that uh, are not the same with the previous one, you return false right away because this is definitely not allowed. You can have repeated, but if you move on with the character, that is not, uh, that actually fail the if statement case, then you do have to know this is the character is not inside the character name string. So just have to return false. So they just type it, type up chart at a j. Uh, it's not equal to type dot char at a j minus one, and everything else you just return. Return what? You cannot you cannot return true right away because you have to make sure your i the i pointer is is exactly equal to the length of the uh length of the length right. So i have to equal to n, and this will be your solution. And let's just run it. And uh, I made a typo. T R yeah T R U E right.
And they just, they get it? Alright, it's good. So, this is pretty good. Decent. Alright, let's talk about time and space complexity. So, for the time, you do have to traverse the type string, right? But, uh, on the other side, like, if the string are, uh, are valid, then definitely is uh, all of uh, length of the type, right? But, be honest, it should be all of n plus, right? Like, you have to determine like, which, one is the, which one is greater. Maybe they are the same, maybe not. But this is the, this is the true, uh, true answer for time complexity. And for the space complexity, this is pretty local variable, so uh, it should be all of one. And if you like the video, subscribe or press the like button. And if you have any questions, comment below. And I will see you next time. Bye.